Okay, now to factor this one. Before I can actually factor it, what I need to do is this. Notice, I don't have the same terms. I need to get them in the same terms. Ooh, well, cosecant's one over sine, cotangent's cosine over sine. I don't think that's going to help. But, oh, wait a minute. I got a squared cosecant. Think about my Pythagorean identities. Cosecant squared theta is the same thing as 1 plus cotangent theta minus 1. So I can put these together. Now I can add the 1 and negative 3 together, and it makes what? 2. Now I can treat this just like I would consider the cotangent and x. So if I had x squared minus x minus 2, the factors of 2 are just 2 and 1, which if I take x minus 2 times x plus 1 and FOIL it, I would get this. So therefore, just replace the x with the what? Cotangent. And then we would have cotangent theta minus 2 times cotangent theta plus 1. That's what this one would have factored to. So now I've already factored it. Ooh, very impressive.